This is a sad night for the Macmillan family as we mourn the tragic loss of their son. There are many well wishes that are here tonight in this memorial service to mourn the loss of this young man who were violently shut down and cut down. We are here to pray for the strength of the family and we ask in the media, we are asking the city of Gulfport, we are asking Biloxi, Mississippi, we are asking FBI, we are asking the police system to do a full investigation of this tragic, senseless murder of this young man. We are here to let Mississippi know that this was not an accident. It was plain murder. We are praying, and I know the media is going to pray, but prayer alone cannot bring this young man back to his mother. We are here to say that we are outraged, we are sad, we are grieving. A young man that just started back to school, violently killed from the police system that's supposed to be protecting our young people. We're going to pray and we're going to have words by the grandmother. First, let's do the grandmother first with words. I can't right now. I, I can't let's right pray. Now. Father, in the name of Jesus, here we are looking unto you to heal this family hurt. Lord, we are here to tell you now, we thank you for the life of this young man. We thank you, oh God, that you loan him to this mother, to this father. But tonight we would like to tell you, as you already know, our heart is sad. We have hurt that we can't even describe. Heal us now. You said in your word that you are very present help in the time of trouble. This family is in trouble. Bow your ears and incline your ears to hear our cry. And God, we will be so very careful to give your name to praise. Lord, we pray in tonight that justice will prevail yes, yes. and that it will rule. And God, not allow this to be like other times when senseless murder was swept under the rug. Yes. Be our vindicator. Yes. Be our help in the time of storm. Yes. And give, we'll give your, pray, your name praise. It's in the name of Jesus we pray. Look on every young person that is here, every young man, every young woman. Protect them, God, from the hand of the one that's supposed to protect us. Even protect them from themselves. In Jesus' name, thank God. Amen. Amen. We just want Jesse. That's what we want, justice. My grandson was a good kid. Can everybody repeat after me? We want justice. We want justice. We want justice. We want justice. When do we want it? Now. We want justice now for my grandson, Jaheen McMillan. <laughs> he was only 15 years old. <laughs> <laughs> this is his mother. This is brother right here. 
His sister is right here behind him. And all these people, friends and family and people we don't even know, but we got so much support here. I'm so glad that all of y'all came out to help support my grandson. <laughs> Oh, Lord. Y'all, I, 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 can't, I can't do no more of this. I, I just can't right now. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We want justice. We want justice. We want justice. We want justice. When do we want it? Now. When do we want it? Now. The only thing I just want to say is, my nephew didn't even deserve that. My nephew was only 15 years old. And my nephew was shot in the head at point blank. We won't see my nephew no more. That was the last time I got to hold my nephew's head, and it was on his deathbed. And I would never see him again. You want to say something, Jaden? And I know everybody don't miss my nephew. This is his brother right here also. His oldest brother. I'm in your side, baby. And this is his baby brother right here. Got you, baby. You want to say something, baby? You want to say something, Jaheen? I mean, Josiah. I keep calling him Jaheen. You, Jaden. Chai? Okay. Well, this is his family. He have other family members, but they probably all in the crowd somewhere. But he have a lot of family here. As we getting ready to release the balloon, parents that's here to support this family, this could have been either one of our child. This could have been our little son, our little daughter. So let's not take it lightly. Thought, let's thought, stand by one yeah, another, yeah. black people, with respect. So when the outsiders come in, they will see unity in the black family. That is my prayer for us. I want you to think about something about this young man, Jaheem. As you get ready to release your balloons of memory, how he played a role in your life. Don't let his dying be in vain. Just don't leave this memorial balloon release and go back to your various ways as business as usual. Let's get in some good trouble. Yeah. Let's be a voice here in Mississippi. There will cry out for the George Floyd. People that have been innocently shot down by the police. Let's be their boss. And tell this nation we are tired of it. And we are not taking this sitting down. It's time to speak up. Stand up to be seen. And speak loud to be heard. We want justice. We want justice. When do we want it? Now. You ready? Bow your head. Ready is for our love. Black is because we are mourning. The silver lining have been broken. And now our heart is bleeding. All together as one unit, it's time to release the balloon. You can do it now. We love you, We love you, Jai. We love you, Jai. I know, baby. 
you're gonna need you more so than ever now, okay? He's gonna need you more so than now, baby. He's gonna need you to be here for him, okay? He's your big brother now. You got to be here for him. It's okay, baby. It's okay. I know. What you want with Nana? Huh? Yeah, both of us crying. What you want with Nana? Nana, okay, baby. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. Nana's okay. Nana's okay. <laughs> I end up crying on my best days Trying to convince me 